personally invited by the Royal Highness. Sir, sir, you're trespassing. Please, keep the turn around now. Showed uh, from an early age uh, signs of, of great intelligence and uh, inventiveness. Uh, something that, that no one noticed but his teacher. Now, thanks to uh, her keen eye, uh, she began to, to push little Jeffrey Harder, uh, believing he could make something of himself. Okay, that's enough for me. Not bad. I need a break, though. You know how it works? I don't want to be I think I'm in love. What if the other guard is using the bathroom? Well, it's time. So if that should happen, I should be able to run down and activate the other swipe as well. Okay. But I guess that will need a little practice. Uh, happy to not be at work tomorrow. Sounds like a lot of running around. Hi. What we're oh, paid to do. Started yeah, it'll probably game, never happen. Uh, just like fire drills. Scholarship. Yeah. Soon to be uh, admitted like into schools that his parents could not afford. And... That doesn't make sense. Are you kidding me? I specifically asked for no noise. I'm working on God. my documents here. Is this place Jesus. Built on Indian graveyard or what? That's it. Who turns the radio? I would like to address the Providence partners directly. I want them to know why this is happening. And I have an idea, but it requires you finding a map terminal. And it's on. Now, after graduating from an Ivy League college with full honors, Jeffrey wanted to make a difference. He was, uh, he was uh, brilliant, but he, he was an idealist, and uh, he started working for what he believed was a greater cause. Fate, however, felt he would be more useful in the private sector, and set itself out to lure him to his true calling, working for the hand that fed him. Grooming him in fate's own image when he was needed. When that fateful day finally arrived, Jeffrey, unknown to himself. Ah, you, that uh, it could take everything away from him in a heartbeat. That's enough for now. Hello.
Finally gets what he deserves. Good riddance. 